Welcome back to HodgePodge. There has been yet another update to the Creative Cloud version of Adobe InDesign, and I am surprised to see this update being met with a bit of criticism. To reduce eye strain, Adobe has enlarged fonts and spacing across the entire user interface. Based on what I could see in the comments section on Facebook, I was a bit worried. A lot of people were commenting that the increased size only reduced screen real estate and that it was already hard enough to squeeze in all of the necessary tools onto the page. InDesign's social media team replied saying that the only solution would be to revert the update back to the previous version. But then my question is, what about the future updates to InDesign? Will future updates include two panel size options? More importantly, how big is the difference? I had to find out for myself just how obstructive the new interface was, and so I updated to version 4, and I have to say, to me, the difference is hardly noticeable, to the point that if Adobe never told me, I probably would have never known. I just think a lot of people on the internet like to complain. If you are also having trouble noticing the difference in panel sizes, Adobe has an article about the update showing a before and after sample, side by side. I get why some people might be concerned about the screen real estate, but in my opinion it's really nothing to fret about. However, I do find it to be a little bit annoying that if someone is unhappy with a change, their only option is to revert back to the previous version. Furthermore, the process to do so is way too complicated. Asking you to uninstall, use the Adobe Cleaner tool, reboot your computer, then re-download the software in your preferred version. I mean, really? If you go to the top menu and select InDesign, Preferences, Interface, there already are more than a few settings available to adjust the look of the interface. You would think there would be a slider here to control font, icon, and panel sizes, but there is not. Maybe this is something we can hope to see in a future update. And so that is my recommendation to Adobe. As an industrial designer interested in pursuing UX and UI design, to keep everyone happy just to have the interface a little more customizable. You know, different strokes for different folks. I'm sure for some people, the current update is still not large enough to satisfy their needs. Other people may want the icons and font sizes to be even smaller than they were in previous versions. That's all. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this video to be interesting. If so, please share it with a friend or leave a thumbs up. As always, feel free to check out my other videos and subscribe.